They believe Ali is Allah. But Wallahi, you guys just don't know. Da'wah boy, you're a liar. Repent. Repent, or you're going with them. I, Wallahi, I don't, I don't want you. I don't. I don't want you to do shit. You are obliged now, Dawa boy. You and your companions, or at least you, because it's you that's in the video, to come forward and repent. You're obliged. The biggest threat we face is not from the West. It is not from our leaders. The biggest external threat that we face is from the Shia. From here, I will show the deception, misinformation and ignorance of this individual, this child. Look, there is a narration of this in which it says anyone who does not do tuqya, in other words, a lie about their religion, فَلَا إِمَانَ لَهُ This person has no iman. So for them, brothers and sisters, it's a part of their iman, it's a part of their religion for them to lie and not tell you what they really believe. You can believe me, and I tell you something. You will not be seen taqiyya from us. Astarafada, from the day Abu Bakr took the rights of Amir al-Mu'mineen Ali ibn Abi Talib, we stood up. And I want to remind Da'wa boy and his companions who we are. We are the followers, we are the Shia of Sayyidat Nisa al Alameen Fatima al Zahra, the woman that stood in the mosque of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sallam and stated the infamous. Words that shook the empire of the tyrant Abu Bakr ibn Abi Quhafa, where she stated, kufr. Fight the Imams, the leaders of disbelief. You are going to wish that I never came forward to do this series.